Hey guys, so I got a special treat for you today. Came home, found this in the mail. I ordered the new Offworld Invader V3 with the uh, Mylar laminate. Kind of excited. Uh, came with some extra stuff I wasn't quite expecting. Stuff from my receipt. Nice little rudiment poster. That's going to be really handy. But I uh, haven't played on one of these before, so like I did with the Zymox one, uh, I'm going through it with. I'm going through it with you guys as as I'm learning about it. So let's go ahead and undo this one. Hopefully I don't injure myself like I did with the last one. God, that would suck. Give me a okay. Almost. Yeah, if you guys end up getting one of these, just make sure you use two hands. It's really frustrating. Oh. Okay, got it out. So, I got it in uh, chameleon blue. Kind of changes colors in the light. It's pretty, uh, that's actually pretty cool. A lot of people told me it was pointless to get the chameleon blue. Might as well not pay the extra five for it. Frankly, I think it's worth it. For the extra five, it looks cool. So, it feels a lot like the surface of the, um, the carbon fiber laminate from the Zymox. It feels a lot like it. Apparently it's not the same. Apparently this is a mylar laminate, which kind of mimics it. And a lot of people told me it's not worth it, and you might as well get the Zymox since it's actual carbon fiber. Frankly, I don't care, as long as it feels good. And it does. Yeah, it feels pretty comfortable. So, I can live with that. Um, bottom is pretty much the same. So, it's pretty good. Um, Alright, so we'll go into it. Um, pretty much your regular invader. I actually have my old one here. This one, it was... Actually, this one's actually my friend. He gave it to me. He got it maybe two years ago. And frankly, it's still in pretty good condition. So, so frankly, invader is pretty rep reputable with their, with their products. Unlike Zymox. Um, I mean, I have my Zymox pad. Uh, I've been meaning to compare it to the Invader. I know a lot of you guys asked about that. I never got really got a chance to, but now I'm going to go ahead and do it now. I'm going to go ahead and compare this one to the the Zymox to the new uh, off world So this one is a wood base, and I called it. I called it in my last video. The wood base was going to fall apart. I've had this pad since I think June, and I. I the wood base is starting to fall apart, the lugs are coming out, you can see it's in pretty bad condition. And I called it, I knew it was going to happen, the wood base was going to fall apart. The laminate is still in great condition, and so is the so is the rim, it's just, it's just that base, I guarantee you. And still a little on the heavy side, kind of wish it was a little bit longer. As you can see, the uh, invader is a little bit bigger, kind of gives it more of a real feel of the drum. Um... Well, this one basically is just a regular off-world, regular off-world invader, just with the the mylar laminate on it. Um, it does make it more articulate. It feels, it does feel a little better. I haven't really seen too many people talk about that. Um, but yeah, just to compare it, frankly, this is gonna last a lot longer than that will. Um, kind of happy with what I got. It was good. I think maybe seventy. Uh, the receipt right here, actually. It was, uh, there you go, $69.95 with $10 tax. So, it was about a good price to pay for it. Frankly, it's worth it. I paid like 80 for that thing, and it didn't barely last me a year. I'm actually going to give it to one of the freshmen at my school. Because I don't want it anymore, because I have this. Anyway, but it's still a great pad. Like, don't not get it. It's just... If you want a pad that's gonna last a long time, get an Invader because these things are more these things are more uh, unibody, so they're gonna last you a longer time. Like the worst condition one I've seen was a friend of mine who actually like the the rim was tearing apart from from the playing surface. That was the worst I've seen so far in Invader. And that's like a rare occasion. But um, yeah, I'm not quite going into a deep deep review as I'm going into like I did with that one. It's just a lot of you guys pretty much know about the regular Invader already. Basically, it's just the same thing. It's just got the 
mylar laminate on it. It feels just like carbon fiber, like I can't really tell the difference. I got the reflective blue one, it looks beautiful. So yeah, frankly out of all the pads I've ever played on, this one was the best. The shuttle is still the worst. I can't tell you how much I hated the shuttle. But yeah, go ahead and get this pad, haven't seen too many reviews on it. I'll probably post a video like of playing a lick on it or something later. I don't know. Uh, sorry, by the way, sorry I haven't been posting too many videos in HD lately. Uh, I haven't had internet for the past couple of weeks. So I've been uploading everything directly off my phone. So, okay, go ahead and enjoy and let me know what you guys think. Any questions, comments, or concerns, just go ahead and comment. Uh, if you want me to post any, uh, any further details regarding this pad, I will. Just ask. And uh, thank you to all my subscribers. Have a good time.